creatures of our God and King, lift up your voice and with us sing. Alleluia, alleluia. Opening sun with golden beam, on silver moon with softer gleam. Alleluia, 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 alleluia. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, love of God, and the communion of the Holy Spirit be with you all. And with your spirit. To prepare ourselves for this Holy Mass, let us examine our conscience. And if I find something wrong in me, like a prodigal son, Repent about it and say to our Lord, I am sorry, through a silent confession. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. May Almighty God have mercy on us, forgive our sins, and bring us everlasting life. Amen. Let us pray. May our prayer of petition rise before you. We pray, O oh Lord, that with purity, unblemished, we, your servants, may come as we desire to celebrate the great mystery of the incarnation of your only begotten Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. A reading from the book of the prophet Isaiah. The desert and the parched land will exult. The steppe will rejoice and bloom. They will bloom with abundant flowers and rejoice with joyful song. The glory of Lebanon will be given to them. The splendor of Carmel and Sharon. They will see the glory of the Lord the splendor of our God. Strengthen the hands that are feeble. Make firm the knees that are weak. Say to those whose hearts are frightened, Be strong, fear not. Here is your God. He comes with vindication. With divine recompense, He comes to save you. Then will the eyes of the blind be opened, the ears of the deaf be cleared, then the lame leap like a stag, then the tongue of the mute will sing. Streams will burst forth in the desert and the rivers in the steppe. The burning sands will become pools and the thirsty ground springs of water. The abode where jackals lurk will be a marsh for the reed and papyrus. A highway will be there, called the Holy Way. No one unclean may pass over it, nor fools go astray on it. No lion will be there, nor beast of prey go up to be met upon it. 
It is for those with a journey to make, and on it the redeemed will walk. Those whom the Lord has ransomed will return and enter Zion singing, crowned with everlasting joy. They will meet with joy and gladness, sorrow and mourning will flee. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Our God will come to save us. Our God will come to save us. I will hear what God proclaims, the Lord, for he proclaims peace to his people. Near indeed is his salvation to those who fear him, glory dwelling in our land. Our God, God will come to save us. us. Kindness and truth shall meet. Justice and peace shall kiss. Truth shall spring out of the earth, and justice shall look down from heaven. Our God, God will come, come to save, save us. us. The Lord himself will give his benefits. Our land shall yield its increase. Justice shall walk before him, and salvation along the way of his steps. Our God will come to save us. God. 
Then, astonishment seized them all, and they glorified God and struck with it all. They said, We have seen incredible things today. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. For our church's prayerful Advent preparation for Christmas, we pray to the Lord. Lord, hear, hear our prayers. For the conversion of the human heart, we pray to the Lord. Lord, hear, hear our prayers. For the peace of our world, especially in the Middle East and Holy Land, we pray to the Lord. Lord, Lord hear, hear our prayers. For the unity of all God's people, we pray to the Lord. Lord, hear, hear our prayers. For the sick, suffering, poor, powerless, and unemployed, we pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayers. For the defense of all human life and religious liberty, we pray to the Lord. Lord, Lord hear our prayers. For vocations to the priesthood and service of the church, we pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayers. For those who have been away from the sacraments, that they may come closer to Christ for Christmas. We pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayers. For our catechumens and candidates who journey with us during this sacred season of Advent, we pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayers. For our beloved dead and the comfort of all who grieve, we pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayers. For our silent intentions, we pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayers. Blessed are you, Lord God of all creation, for through our goodness we have received the bread we offer you, fruit of the earth, work of human hands, it will become for us the bread of life. Blessed be God forever. By the mystery of this water and wine, we may come to share the divinity of Christ, glory itself to share with our humanity. Blessed are you, Lord God of our creation, for through our goodness we have received the wine we offer you, fruit of the wine. Work of human hands, it will become our spiritual drink. Blessed be God forever. Wash me, Lord, with iniquity and cleanse me from my sins. Pray, brethren, that my sacrifice and yours may be acceptable, God the Almighty Father. May the Lord may accept his sacrifice at your hands for the praise and glory of his name, for our good and good of all his holy church. Accept, we pray, O Lord, these offerings we make, gathered from among your gifts to us. And may what you grant us to celebrate devoutly here below gain for us the price of eternal redemption through Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Lift up your hearts. Lift them up. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right and just. It is truly right and just our duty and our salvation, always and everywhere to give it thanks. Lord, Holy Father, Almighty and Eternal God, through Christ our Lord, for he assumed at his first coming the loneliness of human flesh, and so fulfilled the design you formed long ago and opened for us the way to eternal salvation, that when he comes again in glory and majesty, 
and all is at last made manifest. We who watch for that day may inherit the great promise in which now we dare to hope. And so, with the angels and archangels, with thorns and dominions, and with the hosts and powers of heaven, we sing the hymn of your glory, as without the end we acclaim. Holy, 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 holy Lord. Lord, God of power and might, heaven and earth are full of your glory. Hosanna in the highest. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. Hosanna in the highest. You are indeed holy, O Lord, the fourth of all holiness. Make holy, therefore, these gifts we pray by sending Lord your Spirit upon the like to do for, so that they may be for us the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. At the time, he was betrayed and entered willingly into his passion. He took bread and giving thanks, broke it and gave his disciples saying, Take this, all of you, and eat of it. For this is my body, which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice and once more giving thanks, he gave his disciples saying, Take this, all of you, and drink from it. For this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many, for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. The mystery of faith we proclaim God and the Lord and profess the resurrection until you come again. Therefore, as we celebrate the memorial of his death and resurrection, we offer the Lord the bread of life and the chalice of salvation, giving thanks that you have held us worthy to be in the presence and minister to you. Humbly we pray that partake of the body and blood of Christ, we may be gathered on by the Holy Spirit. Remember, Lord, your church, spread throughout the world, and bring her to the fullness of charity. Together with Francis our Pope, David Dukes our Bishop, and Bishop Retired Catechist, Gillery and all the clergy. Remember your servant, Elroy Lemel Sr., whom you have called from this life to yours ever. Grant that he was united with your son in a death like his may also be one with him in his resurrection. Remember also our brothers and sisters who have fallen asleep in the hope of the resurrection and all who have died in our mercy. Welcome them into the light of our face. How mercy on us all we pray that the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, with the Blessed Joseph, her spouse, with the Blessed Apostles, and all saints who have pleased her throughout the ages, we may merit to be co heirs eternal life, praise and glorify you through your Son, Jesus Christ. Through him, and with him, and in him. O God Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever and ever. Amen. At the same years, command and formed by divine teaching, we dare to say, Our Father, who art in heaven, Hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done, honored as it is in heaven. 
Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Deliver us, Lord, we pray, from every evil. Graciously grant the peace in our days, that by the help of your mercy we may be always free from sin, safe from distress. As we await the present hope and the coming of our Savior Jesus Christ, for the kingdom, the power, and glory are yours now and forever. Lord Jesus Christ, whose repulsions of peace I leave you, my peace I give you. Look not on our sins, but on the faith of our Church, and graciously grant your peace and unity in the God of our will, who live forever and ever. The peace of the Lord be with you always. And with your spirit. Let us offer each other the sign of peace. Peace be with you. Peace be with you. Jump of God. You take, take away the sins of the world. world. Have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take us away the sins of the world. Have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take us away the sins of the world. Grant us peace. Behold. Behold in the Lamb of God, behold the King who takes away the sins of the world. Blessed are those called to the support of the Lamb. Lord, Lord I am not worthy that you should come to my grave, but only say the word, my soul, soul shall be healed. healed. Let us pray. May these mysteries, O Lord, in which we have participated, profit us, we pray. For even now, as we walk amid passing things, you teach us by them to love the things of heaven and hold fast to what endures. Through Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. The Lord be with you. With your spirit. May Almighty God bless you, the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Go in peace to proclaim the good news through your life. Thanks be to God.